What is Wheel Alignment? 5 Benefits of Wheel Alignment 5 Signs Your Car Need Wheel Alignment Causes of Wheel Misalignment Why It's Important to Fix in Wheel Alignment Frequently Asked Questions What is Wheel Alignment? Wheel Alignment Sometimes Referred to as Braking or tracking is part of standard automobile maintenance that consists of adjusting the angles of wheels to the car manufacturer specifications. The purpose of these adjustments is to reduce tire wear and to ensure that vehicle travel is straight and true, without pulling to one side. Alignment angles can also be altered beyond the maker's specifications to obtain a specific handling characteristic. Motorsport and off-road applications may call for angles to be adjusted well beyond normal for a variety of reasons. You can maximize your vehicle's steering response and maintain its driving direction by checking your vehicle's wheels regularly according to the manufacturer's guidelines. If they have become misaligned you should realign the suspension as well as the wheels by correcting the wheel alignment angles. Toe Angle Toe angle is the left or right tire assembly slant and is the extent to which your tires turn inward or outward when viewed from above. If you find that confusing, just stand up and look down at your feet. Angle them inward toward the center of your body. When the tires on your car are angled the same way, we call this toe in alignment. Angle your feet outward and you have toe out alignment. Both require adjustment. Camber angle. Camber angle is the inward or outward angle of the tire when viewed from the front of the vehicle. Too much inward or outward tilt, also known as negative and positive camber indicates improper alignment and will need to be adjusted. Caster Angle Caster angle is the vertical axis of a vehicle's steered wheels which helps balance steering and provides stability when cornering. Specifically, it's the angle of your steering axis when viewed from the side of your vehicle. If you have positive caster, the steering axis will tilt toward the driver. Negative caster, on the other hand, means the steering axis tilts toward the front of your vehicle. 5 Benefits of Wheel Alignment Increased Fuel Efficiency When the alignment of your car is off, your wheels aren't working together in harmony. This means that your car has to work much harder to move in any direction, reducing fuel efficiency. Poor fuel efficiency can cost you a lot of money over time. Experience a Smoother Ride You'll notice that your car drifts a bit to the right or the left when the alignment is off, even when your steering wheel is aimed straight ahead. You'll have to be constantly steering to keep your car moving forward, which no one wants to do. Improved Steering Stability If your car's wheels are out of alignment, it's harder to steer. You may even find yourself holding the steering wheel at an awkward angle to drive the car straight, or veering from side to side. This lack of control increases your likelihood of being involved in an accident. Proper wheel alignment means you're able to steer clear of those problems and maintain stable control of your car. Reduce future repair costs. Continuing to drive your car while the alignment is off will cause other parts of your car to break down unevenly and sooner than they should. Every time you hit a pothole, which we have no shortage of, your steering and suspension systems take a hit increases the life of your tires everyone knows that tires wear down and need replacing over time but you can extend the life of your tires by ensuring that your wheels are properly aligned when your wheels are aligned correctly your car doesn't have to work as hard and ultimately causes less wear and tear on the vehicle if you're close to your vehicle right now check your tires to see if they show any signs of these three types of uneven or premature tire wear feathering Tires become feathered when the tread is smooth or worn down on one side and sharp on the other. This type of tire wear occurs when there's a combination of improper alignment settings. Camber wear Is the inside or outside edge of your tire tread looking much more worn than the center of the tread? It could be due to camber wear. Camber refers to the angle of your tires on the vehicle frame, and it can be positive or negative depending on the angle. Positive camber Tilting outward, is usually helpful to keep recreational vehicles stable, while negative camber, tilting inward, helps high-performance vehicles handle turns. While some positive or negative camber is good, too much of either is bad. Heel and toe wear 
Those individual sections are called tire tread blocks. When one side of a tread block appears to be wearing down faster than the other in your tire's rolling direction, it's called heel and toe wear. A symptom of heel, toe wear can be noise or vibration. 5 Signs Your Car Need Wheel Alignment With all the advances in vehicle technology and performance, it can be difficult to keep up with all the required maintenance and repairs. Proper wheel alignment is one of the most important criterion to keeping your car driving safely and happily. Unfortunately, it's also one of the most overlooked. Many people deal with the signs and symptoms of poor wheel alignment, often unaware that it's an easy fix. Wheel alignment problems can become apparent while driving or when your vehicle is stationary. Here are ways to identify poor wheel alignment. When driving. Your steering wheel is off-center when driving straight. If you're driving straight down a flat, level road, your steering wheel should be sitting close to perfectly straight. There's usually a small amount of discrepancy allowed depending on the crown of the road, but overall the wheel should be sitting centered and straight, and your vehicle emblem in the center of the steering wheel should appear level to you. If the wheel is off-center by more than a few degrees in either direction, it's time to have an alignment performed. This will return your steering wheel to center, and may improve the overall drivability as well. Your vehicle pulls to one side or the other. Similar to the first point, vehicle pull is most easily noticed while driving straight down a level road. There is a common misconception that the vehicle should drive perfectly straight with your hands off the steering wheel. In a perfect world, this would be true but in reality this isn't the case because all roads have some degree of crowning which causes a slight pull to one side. Completely removing your hands from the steering wheel is also very dangerous. Instead, the vehicle should drive straight ahead with very little effort on the steering wheel. If your car pulls to one side or the other, it's time to have your alignment checked and corrected, which usually corrects the vehicle pull and improves overall drivability. You notice abnormal tire wear in certain spots. Tire wear patterns can provide a lot of useful information about the condition of a car. A qualified technician can use tire wear patterns to make educated guesses about tire pressures, suspension condition, and alignment problems. Wear on only the inside or outside edges of tires can indicate a problem with the camber adjustment. Feathering or scalloping of the tires often indicates a problem with the toe adjustment. Tire wear is most often noticed by a mechanic while performing a tire rotation or an inspection performed during a service. Proper alignment greatly increases the life of your tires, so if you have any abnormal tire wear patterns, you should have an alignment performed on your vehicle. The handling feels loose when driving. If the steering in your car feels a little loose or unstable, one of the possible causes is poor wheel alignment. This can be felt as wandering across the road when driving, or the car may feel very loose and sloppy around corners. If you notice symptoms like this, you should have the alignment checked and corrected if necessary. Your steering wheel doesn't return to center. After completing a turn, the steering wheel should naturally start to return to center on its own as you keep driving. Of course you need to keep your hands on the wheel to help it achieve this quicker and keep control of the car. But if your steering wheel doesn't even attempt to move itself back to center, then it's a good indication that your alignment is off. Have an alignment check done, and a full alignment performed if necessary. While stationary. Park your car with the wheels pointing forward and stand a few meters in front of it. Look at both sides of your car and inspect whether your wheels are standing straight up or are slanting inwards or outwards. Causes of Wheel Misalignment Wheel alignment problems can occur gradually as a result of poorly maintained roads and vehicle wear, or suddenly from impact. The most common causes of slow wheel misalignment are Suspension component wear Massive torque and friction from driving placing pressure on shocks, springs and tires. More drastic causes of wheel misalignment include Hitting potholes at speed Crashing into large road obstacles Parking against pavements forcibly. Why it's important to fix an alignment. If your vehicle is not aligned properly, 
you risk prematurely wearing out your tires and creating some potentially dangerous driving hazards. When vehicles are out of alignment, the tires wear unevenly comparative to each other. Tires will begin to change in appearance by looking rough or torn. Poor tire tread on your tires affects the car's ability to stop, especially in inclement weather. If your tires appear abnormal, don't hesitate to take your vehicle to a service center for inspection. While manufacturers do not have a set time frame for when alignment should be performed, trust your instincts. If your vehicle is able to drive in a smooth, straight line your vehicle is likely properly aligned. However, it is recommended you have your alignment checked often, such as at every oil change and especially when you've purchased new tires to prevent uneven tire wear. Frequently Asked Questions Is it bad to drive a car with a bad alignment? Driving a vehicle with improper wheel alignment can cause uneven wear on the tires. If the problem is not corrected soon enough, a vehicle's tires could suffer premature wear and tear, making them ineffective for safe driving. An alignment problem should be corrected immediately to avoid unnecessary tire damage. How fast will tires wear with bad alignment? A small misalignment will shorten tire life by a few thousand miles, a major misalignment will wear tires out in a few hundred miles. If the car is wandering, pulling to one side or shaking when driving, get an alignment. It might save you hundreds by making your tires last as long as possible. What happens if you don't fix alignment? When your car's wheels aren't properly aligned it can cause your tires to wear very quickly or unevenly. You may even notice that your steering wheel may pull to one direction or another. This can potentially be very dangerous if you're driving in the rain and the vehicle hydroplanes. Should you get in alignment with new tires? We recommend an alignment after the installation of new tires. This helps you get the most life from your new tires. Wheel alignment checks are always advised after a significant impact or uneven tire wear is detected. Also, get a check annually or twice yearly if you typically travel on rough roads. What parts affect alignment? There are a few components to understand regarding alignment, toe, camber, and caster. In addition, every suspension component, from bushings and ball joints to control arms and shocks, plays some role in the primary alignment angles. If you love this video, share it with your friends. Your support has inspired me to keep developing many videos. Thanks for watching.